made with these people. Okay, well, welcome. I'm Tyler Norman, uh, Tyler 2. Play uh, some Vortex Point. Ooh. Espanol. Duce, is that what I'm gonna say? Oh, that's, that's Dutch. Dutch. Okay. You guys should go play this game just because it has its own intro and it's very interesting. I have to scream. Can I think I can Carolina? Why do you not go? Ah! Scary. I, I miss the old opening, the one picture that was a little too freaky for the rest of the cartoony world it presented. Whatever, let's, let's start this. Okay, when you go up, we have a new case. Uh, new case already. I want to slowly let's move into the new office. Ooh, we got this bubbly. Is it Frag? That was the police last night. Two people have been murdered or beaten. Officers couldn't find any fingerprints at the scene, which is very suspicious. Because usually suspects leave fingerprints. They can't talk. They're like a cousin. No, they're not murdered. They, uh, they were beaten. Alright. Let's start to investigate. Do you guys like my t shirt? It has an alien on it. Do you like my, my facial hair? It looks like an M. Strongly says you go investigate. <sighs> Caroline, please. I don't take no orders from no woman. I'll start to make a profile of the mysterious attacker. You better. Okay, Craig. Got a chart that has been spelling as the ghost for you for 13. Yes! Isn't 13 not a good number? Pigeon. I can't read those. Never stop believing. Never stop believing. Ooh, we can go to the crime scene. Who the heck are you? Hello there. I'm here to waste your time. Well, I left my time to be wasted. But no, I got some questions to ask about last night. Now nah, let's play a game. Pay five dollars and start playing. No. Ah, he's one of those, those street performer carny guys. Okay, let's I'll, I'll play in your game. No, no, never mind. I got I got a crowd to investigate. Hey, I was a policeman once. You received a call from one of the neighbors is here screaming in the patrol car to check out the place and found that the victims were heavily beaten. That sounds brutal. I mean, this is a cartoon for these things. I believe the attacker of apartment A6 is the first thing. Oh. Uh, if you just saw that face, I was, <laughs> I was thinking of my joke. If, if I would have recorded the audio scene, I would have wrote it. Uh, uh, has Chris Brown been questioned yet? He's, he's been known for, for beating people. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Not to Chris Brown. Uh, you call this art? You need to art school to draw this. It's ugly. This I go. I can't even out reading letter. Our stops in the middle. Lots of art books. 
Ooh, painting. Let's interpret. Looks like Pandora's box. And if you look on the outside, there's a dark blue color. That might be the despair. Because it's a contrast of colors with the orange and stuff. And yeah. And I could have, you know, probably. Let's turn the lights off. No? You have one of those UV you, you, you can check the scene. Please looks like my room. I'm like to an artist too. They're both artists. What a mess. What a mess. Nice painting. Man must be very talented. Well, thank you, because those are my paintings. Work of art. <laughs> not finding a lot of clues here. Better not touch that. Better not. Well, why not? Okay, I'm going back. I know you This makes sense. It seems that both mud dust clay footprints. I might be jumping to conclusions, but let me tell you a story. It took place a long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. Forget. Hey, that was on the side. That's cool. Uh, where is Brigade? That's Italy, so. Maybe somewhere like uh, Slovenia, Slo Slovakia, maybe even Russia. Who knows? Everything is Russia. Well, not yet. That that red right line. The golem. <laughs> you think it's a gossip? Rabbi Jacob. Oh, your name is Rabbi. Is that awkward? No smoking. It's America. You can do what you want. So kill it with it. Oh, pizza. What's up, Gabe? Well, I'm waiting for the cheese truck to come. I can't make pizza without you. <laughs> Typical. I have a pizza place. We don't have any cheese, though. You can have anything without cheese. Okay, I'll have pizza. Nope, that red. No, no. Cheese bread. No. That's a no. Breadsticks. Nope, we only serve those with cheese in them. Oh. Do you have any pasta? Nope, all our pasta not cheese. Oh. Oh. Famous cabinet. Oh, the rabbi knows me. To my humble home. So finally, I get to meet Craig. Told me so much about your adventures. Well, they're not really adventures, they just kind of stay in the office all day and I kind of investigate crimes. It's pretty cool. You were asking about a, a golem. Or a golem. Not the one from Lord of the Rings, no. I don't know. It's girls. Are you exactly gonna be that? You need a few passages from the Shuri Yatsugig, the Book of Creation. Let's just call it the Book of Creation. Don't want to be offensive. It's funny you ask because I used to have the book of creation until yesterday. What happened to it? I was out to buy milk and some fruit. And I got back in the bookcase that contained the book of creation. So open the lock of the bookcase was broken. It had a lot of te it had teeth marks in it. Teeth in it. Tooth. Teeth. No, I'm not, not pee, but I'm not going to. 
its teeth. Okay, let's, let's, ooh, that's a nice clock. You can take it if you want. Uh, no, I kind of don't want your broken clock. Maybe a little, no, I don't want a broken clock. Yeah, I'll take it. It said no one. Anyway, let's do that thing. We found the bucket. Uh, I kind of have not left your apartment. Let's look at this. Oh, it's a puzzle. I have never known of an alarm clock with a puzzle inside of it. Just wanted to point out the obvious. Yeah, I don't want. To, I don't want to solve this. Don't want to solve this really. But let's just look at it. Never mind the shapes, geometry, math. Not to my strong point. What looks in it? How do I get out? Get out of Rabbi Jacob's apartment. Okay, well, I figured that out. It looks like we're out of time. I'm, I'm out. See you guys later. We'll finish the series.